Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's your host KO and today I wanted to talk to you about my fertilizers and also my dosing schedule. So the first fertilizer that I dose is the Aquarium Co-op Easy Green. This is an all-in-one fertilizer as it says but it still is missing a couple key components so that's why I went on to purchase other fertilizers to help compensate for what it's missing. Another one is Aquarium Co-op as well, Easy Iron, Easy Carbon, and I also dose their root tabs. So the best thing about these is it's very easy instructions. One pump per 10 gallons. It's got a pump top and that's for all of their products. I also have Flourish, the Flourish line, Flourish, Excel, Nitrogen, Phosphorus, Potassium, Iron, and Flourish Advance. So if we come over here, this is my dosing calendar. So today is August the 7th, Tuesday. So E-I-E-C. Uh, what does that mean? So, I have them all written down right here by letter coding for each fertilizer that I have. So, EI and EC would be number two and number three, easy iron and easy carbon. So, I would go back and dose those. And then tomorrow, which is the eighth, it will be flourish. Flourish Potassium and Flourish Advance. As you can see right there, Flourish number 4F, Flourish Potassium number 9K, and Flourish Advance number 6FA. So I just wanted to share this with you guys. I mean, this made my life so much easier. Not being like, oh man, what did I dose yesterday? Or I go ahead and write it out to what I need to dose for the whole month and this isn't dialed in by any means I mean I've always I've only been messing around with it for about a week and a half and I've only had my co2 set up on my 29 gallon for about five days I've seen some pretty significant changes I was losing the fight to algae. My angelfish are getting ready to spawn and they just pecked that Anubia so much that it came out of the driftwood. But that's basically where your algae comes from. I mean it's either too much in a plant tank, it's either too much light and not enough fertilizer or too much fertilizer and not enough light. So it takes a while to mess around with it and get dialed into your specific tank. I mean even the number of plants or how big they are determine how much fertilizer you're going to put in. So it's going to take me a while and like I said it's not dialed in by any means. But if you want to try out this system it has helped me a hundred times. I mean, it just makes it so much simpler. And I also did it for my food as well. But if you like this, or you're doing something different that you think maybe I should try that'll make it easier on me, please comment. Please subscribe in the bottom left and check out any other videos I have in the bottom right. And I plan on doing a video of that new guppy tank I got going on. So hit the notification bell and stay tuned for that. Until next time, see ya.